Ahí va la migración correteando otro cabrón Acaba de cruzar pero ya se les peló Rutina todos los días, prendemos la sal I just picked up this little project toy So we can ride around It wasn't running, it needed some uh, TLC It's running now We get a little tune up I took it for a spin and the wheel bearing came off so we're gonna have to fix that or order some new wheels the engine is uh, running pretty good Estamos en, el, uh, en the crossing here between Mexico and Progreso and we just got a red light my wife got a red light as well right over there and then this one is the one that I was bringing back from Mexico apparently that's an issue so now we're gonna get a K9 inspected Two vatos just wasting our fucking time here Oh, algo que sí quería mencionar raza es que no le teman aquí a los de la migración Otra persecución, niños pitines, no le entiendo más de ver Pero como les digo, el que no debe no teme um, you, don't, don't, you don't have to answer those questions Today I'm going to be selling my 26s That were on the top of Giving them a quick wash before they come and pick them up Eso vas a pagar Ahora se quedaron mamalones. Ready to go. ¿Qué onda raza? Aquí están los new owners de los 26s. Ya vinieron de aquí de Bronzo. Omar. Omar y el compa. El compa Carlos, yes sir. Aquí están los new owners de los 26s. No, ahí estamos compa como... These are the ones that were on my Yukon Denali 2011, the third row. I'm about to get rid of these. I got rid of some uh, MBS third row leather seats también yesterday. Got rid of the the wheels, uh, those GMC reps 26s también. The day before yesterday and on Wednesday, I sold the, the red car that I crossed over Mexico, the Caliber. También, so all this week I've been ma making some uh, some quick cash. Wait, I need por estos. Permission. So I sold the wheels. I sold the other third row seats. I'm selling these right now. I sold a, a moped scooter. También. So it's been a pretty good week. Not bad for making some extra cash during my vacation.
is clean. On the drag radios, we're gonna put the Circle D converter on. Circle D converter? Yeah, it's a 3000 Circle D triple disc billet converter. Are you running stock transmission? Stock transmission, Punisher valve body, uh, b &M deep trap, uh, transpan. Runs real good like that. trying to run a 450 454 right yeah there's not i know a guy that has one here but uh i don't think he's like races and stuff like that so yeah. Yeah, i mean when i do go to the track the ls1 trucks real quick to like line up just to say they they could beat a gen 1 lightning but we're talking about 20 some years of technology you know <laughs> yeah i mean there's already an f-150 coyote that with the turbo already ran nines is the, it, stock is motor. It the red one the red one smr yeah yeah so yeah, let me see a stock Chevy truck do that, you know what I mean? I'm a fan of trucks, man, so I mean, I'm, I'm a Ford guy, but I mean, I'm a, I'm a fan of speed, so. And everything. Oh yeah, man, it's on low and it's cold. It feels cold, man. That's badass. Yeah, everything works on the truck, man. It's insane. So where can people check you out, man, on Instagram or something? Uh, yeah, at Roost Racing, that's where I'm at. So All right. You'll see a couple of my vehicles there. <laughs> Andamos en una, we're at a house tour, trying to look for our new space. This is the house that we're currently looking at. It's a three, three, two, three bedroom, two bath, with a one garage. Got the living room, some weird fan. Kitchen.
just got back from uh, seeing that uh, white house that I showed you guys earlier in the video. That's the, the realtor couldn't get in. We're gonna leave that, uh, that house tour for another day when they can get that, uh, that lock deal open. So, como quiera este, a ver, a ver que pasa. Man, this this whole process is the, it's not as easy as we thought. The business right now for houses are booming. We saw a house last night, and uh, it was posted for like maybe ten hours. And we messaged the realtor like at four in the morning, and uh, he got us to so that we can see it today. There was already like six people that were. Uh, like bidding on the house because it's like a bidding war it's not just like oh pues vamos a agarrar esta, whatever um so we were like nah like ni pa que like we were not even in the bidding like they, like with the six people that were already like on it so we were like nah like not even worth going to go see it but it was it was nice it was a a two-car garage and a decent sized lot the third uh, house that we've seen so far this one has uh four bedrooms and two baths I'm gonna give you guys a little tour. It's a decent size. I mean, we're not a big family, so I'm gonna, just me and my wife and the kids, two kids. Pretty good, uh, decent size yard. So we're at our last location, our last uh, our showing. We're looking at this house right now. And this is a four bedroom, two bath. People are currently living in it right now. It's the, we're really thinking about getting this one. Living room. Hi, Mama. The kitchen. Got granite countertops. Like the ceiling. Let's put it up there. What's wrong, Mama? This is the master bedroom. Check that out. All right, Rasa, we just finished washing the house. This one's pretty nice. It's got four bedrooms, granite tops in the kitchen. It's all brick, central AC. We're gonna try to see if we can go for this one. So comment down below what you guys think. So yeah, we'll, we'll see what happens with this house. I really like the, the space for all the cars. The La Mazda, La Mazda Rati. This is my realtor, uh, Pedro's uh, right. 
So like I said, uh, the people currently live here. They're in the process of moving out. So hopefully we uh, we can make something happen with this home. If not, we got some other uh, other options. But uh, we're really liking this one. Excuse the paletero. But this house is pretty nice. It's got uh, all four rooms are pretty decent. They're they're pretty big compared to the other houses that we've seen. They got a pretty decent size. So basically, basically we're on a waiting game right now. Just to, we're gonna wait for the realtor to get back to us on what's going on with the, hopefully we can make something happen and within about a month, month and a half, we'll move into our new home. So yeah, make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Right now we're gonna go grab something to eat and I'll get back to you guys. Este, that's the reason why uh, why I haven't really finished the truck. Is the been trying to get the family into a to a new house. Once I once we get into the new house, I'm gonna get back on the on the Tahoe, finish it up like a, like I was planning for. We started getting all this stuff happening to our vehicle, so we ended up uh, deciding to search for a new home. So. You guys can understand that and uh, continue watching the videos support the videos the more you guys watch the videos the more uh the more i can give back to you guys in the way of doing giveaways and doing more of the build towards the tahoe and maybe uh getting another project or something for those of you that stick around appreciate it sure y'all like the videos share the videos drop a comment on what you guys think and also uh shout out to everybody that likes the the cumbia mixes that i've been doing and getting a lot of uh feedback a couple of haters here and there but uh, so if you're not if you're not uh getting hate you're not doing it right so shout out to all the haters i mean yeah i just did it as a for personal use i uh, ended up uh like mixing a lot of cumbias so I can download them into my uh, my USB, and people started liking it. So I started putting it out more. And it's, I'm not getting paid for it, just for fun, just for so you guys can jam out or whatever. Pero saludo a toda la raza que le gustan las cumbias. There'll be a lot more coming. Stay tuned. Y otra cosa raza, feliz año nuevo. Espero que hayan pasado bien. Este sé que mucha gente les afectó el COVID y todo ese mal de mis condolencias a la familia de ustedes y, y fueron afectados por esa causa. Yo, yo personalmente tuve dos familiares que, que se nos fueron. Este, se nos cortó tiempo temprano por el, por el COVID. Pero que están en el cielo este, descansando. Mis condolencias a ustedes este, si perdieron a un familiar. Espero que en el 2021 este, les vaya mejor. Si Dios quiere, ya para entonces les este, vamos a tener una, una casa nueva. Muchas gracias a ustedes este, por ver los videos. Este, 
nadie se me agüita por la raza maciza Saludos Tamaulipas, hermosa la vecina Hay mala migración, otra persecución